Reptiles can be both frightening and also pretty cool. In this video, I'd like to talk about what makes a reptile a reptile. Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. Before we get started, let's look at some common examples of reptiles. There are four main reptile groups. They include turtles and tortoises, snakes and lizards, crocodiles and alligators, and the tuatara. Now let's begin to look at some characteristics. Reptiles are egg-laying animals. Although some snakes do bear live young, but strange fact, the eggs actually hatch inside the mother's womb. Reptile eggs are amniotic. This means that they have a fluid-filled bag surrounding the embryo. This prevents the egg from drying out, so they can lay their eggs on dry land. Reptile skin has scales with no hair or feathers. Their scaly skin protects them from drying out. Reptiles shed their skins as they grow, often in one piece. Almost all reptiles have four legs, or the fancy name is tetrapod. Most have short legs and swing their back from side to side when they walk. Most reptiles have three chambered hearts. Alligators and crocodiles, however, have a four chambered heart, much like birds and mammals. Bur reptiles are ectothermic or cold blooded and they have to use the surrounding environment to warm and cool themselves. And also, reptiles are vertebrates, meaning they have a vertebrae column that protects the spinal cord. So there we go, characteristics of a reptile, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.